and on the way on the way back to India, they bring uh, heavy receivers and other electronic components because generally in US you get very good offers. The biggest problem in uh, amplifiers which you can get from US is they are 110 volt version and in India the power supply is 230 volts. So to use an amplifier or electronic components which you have bought from US, you need to have a 110 volts converter like this. This is a small converter, depending on your AV receiver or consumption, we need to go for a higher, higher voltage step down converter. And other issue with the 110 volts amplifier is in the US, the amplifiers are built for 110 volts 60 hertz, and the voltage in India is 230 volts 50 hertz. Even if you, even if you use a step down converter, the voltage will be brought down to 110 volts, but the frequency remains 50 hertz, whereas the amplifier requires 110 volts 60 hertz. Generally, you may not find a major difference in audio, but definitely you will find some variation in video quality. You may, you may find some waviness in video. You should also choose a correct OTA step down converter and if at all you choose a lower wattage step down converter which is lesser than the requirement of the amplifier but your amplifier will get damaged. So to find out what type of converter step down converter is required for your receiver just refer the back panel. Usually it will have 120 volts, 60 hertz and ampere rating. So you have to see this ampere rating. For example this model has 4.7 amps this model has 4.7 amps so you have to multiply 4.7 into 120 volts so that will come to something like uh, 5, 6, 570 watts so this receiver so this receiver will require 570 watts of step down converter so you need to go for a step down converter which can deliver 5, 6, 570 watts minimum take a margin of safety of about 25% so you need to go for a step down converter of 1 kilowatt for a 600 watt uh, heavy receiver. Finally it's uh, recommended to go for 230 volts heavy receiver for Indian voltage condition otherwise if you happen to get a 110 volts uh, heavy receiver you need to go for a very bulky step down transformer which will consume additional power plus it will not give 60 hertz which is required by the AV receiver so you may find some kind of a wavy video and the step down converter will also occupy a lot of space.